I had to call the holler at my homie, man. Spice, what's up, baby? It's Fleetwood. It's probably with it, baby. <laughs> what you mean, you mean? Hey, 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 you, hey, you remember me, Spice? Wait, I, I remember your name. Where I know you from? All uh, right, look, we was in Portland, man. We did the show. It was me, you, Selly Cell, R and uh, RBL Posse. And we rocked the show at the um, Burnside Theater. We did that. You know, I wrote a book uh, called Hip Hop. I wrote the book called Hip Hop Tried to Kill Me. Then a year later, we was at the West Coast Awards show up there fucking with Octavius. Oh, uh, okay. That's what's up. Yeah, okay. I, that's the homie. That's what's up. Yes, sir. So look, man. Right quick, I know I know you got a lot of people want to talk to you, man. I'm down here in Arizona, fuck with Stan the guitar man. Man, I got a lot of radio oh, stations for you. Yeah, I just talked to him today. I got a lot of radio stations for you. Spice anything I can do to support you, man. I got a group called the Cotton Pickers, oh, man. I you know what I'm saying? We hitting them hard like Ghetto Boys and Goody Mob. You feel me? So, man, That's anything I can man. do to support. Anything I can do to support the homie, you know, you know, we from the yay. So anything I can do to support you, man, I got about 30 radio stations for you. You know, if you want to do a book or something, I can give you my formula on that. So, you know, any, you know, anything I can do, man, I'm just here to, you know, support, bro. I'm down here in the desert in Arizona. Hell yeah, get at me, man. You know, you can hit me up on, on Facebook or Twitter or something. I slide you my email. You know, let's work on something. Let's do something. Put, put it together or something. You already know. It's all love, family. So yeah, man, keep doing your thing, man. Salute, man. And I'll be in touch with you, man. Um, before the sun up, man. I hit your people and you know get get your contact from um, Eric and right here. Hell yeah, that's what's up. That's what's up. One love, baby. All right, man. Take care. Yes, sir. All right, bro. Yeah, boy. Uh, we have a five zero two caller. Yo, what's up, man? What's up, man? It's your boy Imperial Real Real in the building, Black Law Representative. First and foremost, shout out to Spice One, a legend in the game. What's up, man? What's going on out there? The five hundred two, baby. Man, maintaining, man, making it happen one day at a time. You know. Uh, first off. I want to speak on that little situation with you and the little, you know, Ronald McDonald head ass nigga. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. yeah, yeah. He should have never fucking disrespected a legend because if it wasn't for niggas like you, he wouldn't even have a shot in this game. See, they don't realize the internet. The internet made it so easy for niggas to become stars now that they don't realize what it means to get in them trenches and really have the brand and get your name recognized. Yeah. yeah, you should have shot that nigga. You should have shot that nigga a two piece to the face and told him, "Look, take this one with you, young, and get out of my face." Yeah, real, <laughs> real, stick, real talk. You know what I mean? Them type of cats out there, you know, we don't, we don't, we don't need them type of cats in the game disrespecting, uh, disrespecting the dudes that laid out the foundation for him. You know, that's that's just straight up disrespect. Like, you know, man. You know, you already know. I'm, I'm gonna hit the studio up and eat his ass up a few times. You got I look to. forward to that. It's, on, it's only fair. You got to. You got to. Because he okay. should have never did that. You know. Yeah, that's the most bad shit, man. And for the rest of these niggas too, you know, these little, little young niggas. You know what I'm saying? Y'all niggas don't want to respect the OGs. They don't respect us. But then again, you know, deal with the consequences too. Shit. Yeah, yeah, you got to look forward to the consequences because for every action, there's a reaction, my nigga. Real spit. So you got to know us. You know, I mean, I know the niggas getting out there and they got a gang of money. You know what I'm saying? Niggas sitting on chip, <laughs> on, on major chips, riding on, on private jets and all of that shit. And, you know, and, and, and it's just this, the, the, the only the thing about it is motherfuckers ain't paying no homage to niggas who even got them to that point. You know what I'm saying? Like, that's that's some sad shit right there. You know what I'm saying? Like, they're like, fuck y'all niggas. You know, y'all showed us the game, but fuck y'all. You know what I'm saying? Exactly. Like, that's how, shit. how can you say that? That's just like, that's just like your parents, that's just like your parents giving birth to you and then after you get grown, you're like, you don't do shit for me. That's a lie. Yeah. That's a lie. That's what's for going real. on. That's exactly what's going on. You know what I mean? And, 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 it, and, it's, and it's, I guess it's up to the parents to whoop their little ass, too. Exactly. But the part that gets me the most is a lot of the OGs is accepting this shit. Yeah, they just accepting it. of it. I don't understand it. I just see niggas sitting up just, 
just taking it, you know what I'm saying? Just like, you know, let these niggas roam around and talk shit about us, you know what I'm saying? I mean, I'm still alive, I'm still walking, you know, I've been shot and all of that shit, you know what I'm saying? I, I'm still walking, I'm still walking and breathing. Nigga ain't got to talk shit, talk shit about niggas like us. Nigga ain't, he ain't even got to say my name specifically, but when he say OG, obviously he talk about me, you know what I'm saying? Because, I mean, shit, it's been, it's been a long motherfucking time, you know. It, with all these platinum and gold plaques and all these shows and all of that shit for years, you know what I'm saying? And um, obviously that's that's who we got to be talking about. So I mean, shit. I mean, if he want a nigga, to, if he want the OG to bring it, then we'll bring it. You know, cause he, he he talking he talking hype shit like you know like fuck us. You know what I'm saying? So I mean, you know, well fuck you too, nigga. On oh, tropical <laughs> ass, nigga, fuck you too. Nigga, we don't, want, we don't want you in the game. Nigga, we don't like you. We don't want your fans. We don't want you, nigga. Any any nigga who, who listen to that nigga, any nigga who listen to that nigga shit, oh, I don't give a fuck if he listen to my shit or not. I don't care. You know what I'm saying? I don't need the niggas and fans. All, all my fans got to be G's anyway. You know what I'm saying? Exactly. You know what I mean? Females and males, you know what I'm saying? I mean, and, and, and real and real motherfuckers gonna recognize the the, the, the wickedness of that nigga's conversation, you know, because he because he because he, he's um, illiterate as fuck. You know what I'm saying? Like I'm, I mean, you my, understand what you're saying and shit. My my whole thing is, how can you respect a nigga that got his sister's jeans on? Yeah, I mean, yeah, for real, you got on. You got on, you got on your motherfucking mama's outfit, and you got this bitch trying to say you the coldest nigga ever, and nobody can even understand a damn thing you saying. Yeah, man. Mama, I respect that. Nigga ain't gonna respect that shit, man. You know what I'm saying? Hell I mean, no. You know, I mean, if if if, if he if he had, especially if he ain't respecting us, shit. You know, I mean, but but you know, it is what it is. You know, when it all comes down to it, it's competition, and, and who can get the most fans. You know, and, and right. I, you know, right now, you know, the niggas like that is niggas like that is winning when it comes to that shit because, um, you know, I mean, that's what that's what the uh, that's what the that's what the music that's the way music is going right now. You know what I'm saying? But I mean, as far as what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna keep doing me. You know what I'm saying? It, it don't even matter. You know, I ain't gonna try to sound like no niggas and all of that. Shit, you know, what I'm, I'm gonna keep doing me and, and just. Keep my fan base and keep that shit real. You know what I'm saying? That's all I need to do. You know, it's the spark. Exactly. Go down, you know, with the niggas, you know, when you see a nigga, you hit the nigga up on the, um, hit, hit that microphone and hit that studio and hit that nigga up and let motherfuckers know how you feel. You know exactly. Exactly.